Hey, what's up, fellas? How you doing, man? It's Anelli here. Hey, what's going on, guys? How we doing, man? It's Anelli here. Today, we are talking Mike Trout. Big, huge new contract. 12 years, 430 million big ones. I'm on my way to high school tryouts right now. I've been asked a thousand times over the last couple days to talk about this and give my thought on the deal. Was it worth it? Was it a good move by the Angels? Bad move. And so I'm going to talk about that right now on my drive. Before I do that, put in the comment section below what you think about this deal. Um, I would be interested to hear what you guys have to think. Okay, let's get into it. So I think the first thing is people are probably going to be yelling about how no player, nobody's worth $430 million, right? A lot of times when I do these videos, it's like doctors and teachers and all these other people should be getting paid money and not baseball players. So let's put that aside for a minute, okay? Let's not, this isn't about our baseball players overpaid. This is just about is Mike Trout's contract is the value of it worth it compared to what other players in the league are getting, okay? That's what we're going to talk about. For me, the answer very quickly before I get into why is going to be yes. I think that this contract is a good deal, okay? I think this is a right deal. I'm not the Angels didn't get this great deal and I don't think Mike Trout ripped them off and is is uh, laughing or well, he is probably laughing his way to the bank, but he's he's not laughing because, you know, he somehow fooled the Angels or got some crazy deal that he didn't deserve. Mike Trout might be the greatest baseball player to ever walk the planet, okay? I know, again, a lot of people are going to be like, what are you talking about? Well, these numbers, okay, I was looking at his numbers. I was looking at his career. It's ridiculous. It's absolutely ridiculous what he has done so far, okay? So, when you look at the numbers, all right, he's, so he's technically played eight seasons, okay, but the first season, he, he didn't get a ton of at-bats. I think he only got like 100 and something at-bats, okay, and so let's just wipe that season out because, again, it's his rookie year, and he was, you know, I don't, I don't know when he got called up during that year, but he didn't play a full season, all right? Let's just look at his full seasons that he played every other year after that rookie year or after that first year, okay? So seven seasons he's played, okay? He is a seven-time All-Star, right? He's made the All-Star team every single year that he's played. He is a two-time MVP, okay? Not too shabby, all right? That alone would be like, wow, he's a really good player, all right? Seven seasons, two-time MVP, yeah. Well, he came in second place in the MVP voting four times, okay? So six of his seven years that he actually got, you know, full seasons... He was either the MVP or second in the MVP. Oh, in that one other season, that seventh season, he came in fourth. The bum. What a bum. Jeez. Only fourth place in the MVP. Unbelievable. They should have traded him. So he has absolutely dominated the league every single season. He was a rookie of the year uh, during his rookie season also. Okay? So he is... He is amazing. And I think most people get that. Although there are some people that maybe because he's on the Angels and they're, they're, they haven't really been that great over the last few years and they play out West, um, maybe not everyone really realizes what he's done, okay? Um, I think real baseball people get it, but maybe not everybody gets it, okay? Here's another interesting stat for you, because I know a lot of people are probably going to be like, Matt, I can't believe you said that he might be one of the best players of all time. Um, obviously, he's still got a long, he's got a long career. He's got 12 more years, hopefully, um, ahead of him. So he's got a long ways to go. But through his age 26 season, check out this number right here, okay? Through his age 26 season right now, he has the most career war through that 26 age season, okay? So... He has a better war, a more combined war than, I don't know, guys like Ty Cobb. He's a pretty good player. Uh, Mickey Mantle, Rogers Hornsby, uh, A-Rod. A-Rod had, had a pretty good career. Um, Jimmy Fox, okay? He's got a 
better war through his age 26 season than all those guys. Career war. Than all those guys, right? So that was the order. That's the order of the list right there. So that is unbelievable, okay? If he keeps this up, I, I think there's probably no doubt he goes down as the greatest player of all time. It'll be interesting to see how much more and how much longer he can he can keep this up because um, it's just, it's, it's like, I, I looked at the numbers and again, I know that he's a stud, right? But when you look at all these numbers, you're like, you just stare at the thing with your mouth open. It's it's unbelievable. Okay, so um, that's my thought on it. Okay, so you give the guy twelve years and and four hundred and thirty million. Like, I don't even know what the number would be that you could give him that you would finally be like, man, he's you know he's not worth that, right? Like he's he's the best player every single season, <laughs> and these other guys that are that are really really good players, right, are signing really, really big deals, um, and he deserves more than all of them, and that's why he got more than all of them, all right, so that's my thoughts on it, I don't think it's super complicated, um, I am actually very interested to hear, I like I said, I do think a lot of people are going to be like, no player's worth that much money, um, but when you're just looking at the other players and what they got, Trout's got to make more than them, and in some cases, got to make a lot more than them, so that's my thought, let me know in the comment section below. Uh, what you guys think. Um, subscribe to the channel. Share the video with all your friends. All that good stuff. Check out all our other videos. I've been throwing up a new... Uh, we've been doing these new vlogs, which I think I've done five so far. So go and check them out. Let me know what you think. Just something new, especially with uh, high school, our high school season kind of upon us now. I uh, wanted to put that up there. So let me know what you think about that in the comment section below as well. And that's all we got. Thanks so much, everyone. We'll talk to you later.